In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for nickel 2 chloride plus ammonium nitrate. So the first thing we need to do when we balance net ionic equations, we have to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. So I can see I have two chlorine atoms here, just one here. I'm going to put a 2 in front of the ammonium chloride. But now I have two ammonium ions. So I want to put a 2 in front of the ammonium nitrate. That fixes my ammonium ions, but now I have two nitrates. That's okay, I have two nitrates here and one nickel on each side. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Next, we'll write the state for each substance. Chloride's very soluble, so AQ, it'll dissolve, break apart into its ions. Ammonium compounds and nitrate compounds, very soluble, AQ. So this will split apart into the ammonium ion and the nitrate ion. We have nickel to nitrate. Nitrates are very soluble, aqueous and then chlorides and the ammonium ion, very soluble. Because of that, when we write the complete ionic equation, we'll have all these ions in the reactants and the exact same ions in the products. Then when we cross out our spectator ions, everything will cross out. There won't be anything there. That means that there's no reaction. So we really can't write a net ionic equation for this reaction. There's no reaction. There's no precipitate that forms in the reaction or a gas or a liquid. So think of it this way. You have these, all these ions dissolved in a beaker. When you start, when you're done, they're all still dissolved there. Nothing's happened, no change, no reaction. This is Dr. B with the net ionic equation, or in this case, no reaction, for NiCl2 plus NH4NO3. Thanks for watching.